Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Science Query. I am a host Dr. Asha and in this video I am going to talk about high viscosity versus low viscosity. So before going into high viscosity and low viscosity, let us first see what is viscosity. Well, viscosity is an important property of fluid. It determines how easily a fluid can flow. From the movement of tear rolling down from your eyes to the honey which you are pouring into the tea all follows the law of viscosity which was proposed by Sir Isaac Newton. The property of viscosity mainly depends upon two factors adjacent layer of fluids and viscosity. Adjacent layers of fluid are the layers of the fluid that are near to each other and each layer is moving at a different velocity. The layers are separated by a small distance known as the boundary layer. So far we have learned about adjacent layers of fluid, different velocities of the layer, boundary between the layer. Next we are going to learn about the viscosity. Due to the different velocities of the layer, the fluid offers some resistance when they are in motion. That is, when the fluid is in motion, there is a resistance between the layers of the fluid and this resistance is known as viscosity. In another word, we can also say that viscosity is a measure of resistance to flow arising due to the internal friction between the fluid layer. Viscosity can also be expressed as a measure of a fluid's thickness or its resistance to object passing through. Now next let us see how to measure viscosity. Viscosity is generally measured by the unit known as Pascal second or centipoise. The SI unit of viscosity is poise. Other units are Newton second per square meter. The coefficient of viscosity pronounced as eta can be measured or defined as the ratio of shearing stress to the strain rate. Now let us see what is high viscosity. High viscosity means more resistance to flow. That is there is a more resistance amongst its internal layer. In simple word we can say high viscosity is the viscosity of the fluid which has a high amount of resistance to the flow amongst its internal layer. Fluid with high viscosity are known as high viscous fluid. Fluid can have high viscosity due to various reasons which include temperature, pressure, molecular interaction and size of the molecules. After high viscosity, let us see what is low viscosity. A fluid is said to have low viscosity if the layers of the fluid easily slide over each other. That is the friction between them is comparatively low and it does not resist the flow of motion of the fluid. Now let us compare the high viscosity and low viscosity in an easy way. High viscosity fluids does not deform easily. They have a high resistance to shear and tensile force. On the other hand, low viscosity fluid deformed easily and does not resist any force. High viscous fluids are thick and sticky whereas low viscous fluids are thin and runny. Resistance to flow is very high in high viscous fluid whereas resistance to flow is very low in low viscosity fluid. Surface tension is very high in the high viscosity fluid whereas surface tension is low in the low viscosity fluid. High viscosity fluids have strong molecular interaction whereas low viscosity fluids have poor molecular interaction. Low temperature and high pressure increase the viscosity whereas high temperature and low pressure decreases the viscosity. Examples of high viscosity fluid are honey and tar. Examples of low viscosity fluids are water and alcohol. Now before closing the video, let us check your knowledge about the viscosity. The first question, friction in the fluid is called A, density, B, surface tension, C, viscosity or D, none of the above. Well, the answer for this question is viscosity. Friction in the fluid is called viscosity. Now let us see the next question. What is the SI unit of viscosity? A. Candela B. Poiseuil, C, Newton per meter, or D, no units. 
Well, the answer for this question is B. Poiseuil. Now let us see the final question. Which of these fluid or fluids have highest viscosity? A. Water. B. Oil. C. Honey. Or D. Blood. Well, the answer for this question is honey. Honey is having the highest viscosity as honey is thickest among all these fluids. Well, that is all about high viscosity and low viscosity. If you like my video, then please subscribe my channel Science Query and please like, share and comment. Thank you.